Now, the WGAL News 8 Storm Team Forecast with meteorologist Ethan Houston. Had some viewers say, and also I've seen a couple shoots coming out of the ground already late this winter. Outside right now certainly feels like spring out there. It's going to feel more like Mother's Day than it's going to feel like the day after Valentine's Day. Crystal clear blue skies on our Harrisburg Sky Cam. May see a few clouds return as we head through the afternoon, but it is warm. 60 right now in the capital city with a gentle breeze out of the south at eight miles per hour. So partly cloudy to mostly sunny out there. Temperatures will top off in the mid to upper 60s, and there is going to be a nice brisk breeze out there out of the southwest, possibly gusting up to near 25 miles per hour. We will stay mild tonight. May want to get open the windows. We're only dropping to near 50 and then for tomorrow temperatures rebound to the upper 50s to near 60 degrees, but be prepared for some scattered showers to return most likely after lunchtime on into the early evening hours. So it's not record breaking warmth, but we're not too far away from the records forecasting a high of 66 for HIA. The average high is 42. The record for today is 74 and we're just adding to our total. So this is another day. So 16 through yesterday. That is the three way tie for the most days at or above 50 degrees for the start of the year. Here's a look at that warmth being pushed in from the southwest. You can see the winds right now up to 13 miles per hour in Lancaster, 14 miles per hour in Redding. We're at 60 right now in the Red Rose City. New Freedom, York County is 60 degrees as well. So as we zoom on out, 60s. 70s, 80s, but then look at the sharp drop in temperatures back off to our west. 36 right now in Kansas City into the teens in Sioux Falls and Denver. That colder air is going to start pushing to the east. So we do have a storm system that moved through the area in the form of a warm front earlier. That's now up into southern Canada, but here's the storm that's building back over the plains. It's going to work its way to the east, interacting with this incoming cold front and give us some showers, but the temperatures are not going to drop until later in the day on Friday. So a beautiful Beautiful spring like day today with lots of sunshine. There's the cold front, but it stays off to our northwest through the day tomorrow. It's once this front gets a little, little closer to us and we start to see the storm move along that front, we'll be dealing with some showers tomorrow afternoon. Then the front lifts up to the north and be prepared for temperatures to be near 60 degrees at midnight Friday. We will still be warm, but then here comes some showers Friday morning. Front moves on by and then down go the temperatures as we head through Friday afternoon. So Friday afternoon is going to be colder than Friday morning. So mid 60s today, upper 50s with scattered showers after lunchtime tomorrow. We'll see some of those showers linger into Thursday night and Friday morning. Front moves on by 50s in the morning, but will cool to the upper 30s after sunset. More seasonal weather, but still above average weather. Dry weather will be around for the weekend.